Hi there, my name's Arwin Bailey. I'm a time lord, capturing moments in time mainly through the art of photography. But talking about networking, do you know, uh, about 18 months ago, I did a survey online, asked my networking buddies and other people in business, how many of them actually record a return of investment for networking? By that, it costs you X amount of pounds to be a member, costs you X amount of pounds for your breakfast, your dinner, your tea, whatever it might be. It costs you X amount of pounds in petrol. And the one thing that everybody misses out is you're going to be at a network meeting for two, three, four hours, depending what it is. What's your hourly rate? It's costing you that much money as well. And then, although we're not selling to the room, and this is very important, and that's something I go into in other videos, it's very important to understand that you need to keep tabs and a track on your return of investment. So you take all those costs and expenses together, including your time. And if you are not getting a return on your investment, why on earth are you still a member of that network? There's one of several things wrong. Either you've joined and it's too soon because it takes between 9 and 18 months to actually get a return on investment. Genuinely, 25 years network, all different networks, between 9 and 18 months to get your return on investment. Okay? So that could be one reason. Second reason could be it's simply a failing network. It's just not working. There aren't new visitors. Um, people aren't referring to one another. People are leaving their networks at the door, as I say. They're not bringing them into the room. It could be any of those things. The third reason could be you. Let's face it. Might be you. Might be your attitude, the way you work a network. Um, it could be your level of service, standard isn't good, whatever. You might have got a bad reputation. Networks are very good places, actually, for behind-the-back gossip. You have to be careful of that. Um, but basically, it could be one of those reasons why you're not getting business. So therefore, you say, okay, what can I do about it? You can plan one-to-ones. You can plan to be on the leadership team. You can plan to give presentations in the main part of the meeting. Several things you can do about it. But if it still doesn't work, then I'd suggest you give up that network and find another one that suits you. Because there's so many out there, and they all claim to be the best. No one is the best. They're different. And you need to choose the one that suits you your philosophy, your business, your products, services, trade, profession, whatever. Plus me, that's Arwen Bailey, the Time Lord. Live long and prosper. May the force be with you. Cheers.